Hi, welcome back to another video of Python 2020. In this video, we will learn how to take a screenshot using Python. And to take the screenshot, we will use PY Auto GUI. As the first action, we will save entire screenshot using Python. And then the next step, we will see how to save partial screenshot using Python. To save the cropped screenshot of the Python, what we will do that we will give the region coordinates. And based on the coordinate, we will save only some part of the screen using python so let's start so here i am on my pycharm if you don't know how to use pycharm there is video number 95 on my youtube channel you can uh, look at that video and if you want to learn more about the web automation excel automation ocr and image automation there are many videos on my youtube channel please subscribe to this channel and look at all other videos which are already uploaded on this youtube channel So we have already started this uh, project and we have seen and this is about the OCR and image automation. You can see the code right now on your screen to get the text from image and to get the text from scan PDF. So now in the same project what we will do from here we will add a so you have to click on this project icon right click here on the project folder new python file screenshot. Now let's minimize this panel. First of all, we have to import required libraries. So right now, you can see on your screen, I have uh, taken these four libraries. PY Auto GUI was already installed. And we have to install OpenCV. So here in this project, what we will do, we will go here in terminal. In the terminal, we have to install this PY OpenCV. And please note the name of library. Now, just enter. Installation is started. It is library is, library is installed successfully. So now next is that we have to save this screenshot. So here is the code for that. I have taken this six second of sleep time. I can open the screen any screen for the illustration purpose. Open Google first of all. This is the screenshot function of PY Auto GUI library. This will save the screenshot and then we are applying the image resolution to that particular screenshot. And then we are saving that particular screenshot in as a PNG file. You can save as JPG file also. So let me run this now. And open this. Let's go back. So it is done successfully. Now let me go to the folder and see that the screenshot is saved or not. You can note the time here. Here we are. You can see the timing here. Click on the screenshot and see. So here you can see this time and this time. Alright, so this is how you can save a screenshot using Python. Now next is that how to save partial screenshot using python or how to crop the screenshot using py auto gui so here is the code for that and i have taken another variable probed image and in the screenshot same screenshot function i have given the region so to get the region so there are so many tools i have used this mouse point viewer exe and from here you can get the screen coordinates I will share the link to download this uh, particular tool. Okay. Now let's uh, run the entire code once again. And this time will be updated here. And this is the partial screenshot. Okay. Now let's run. Let's go back. Code executed successfully. Go to the folder. Now there are two screenshots if you can see of this screenshot second screenshot is less because this is the probe screenshot and this is the complete screenshot so let's open this first of all you can note the time of the screenshot here and this is my computer time goes let's look at the probe one now this is the probe screenshot 
So this is how you can save a screenshot using Python PY Auto GUI for to get complete knowledge or to get more detail on Python PY Auto GUI screenshot function or other functions of Python PY Auto GUI. You can look at this documentation. Here is the link. And to download the utility for getting the coordinates, here is the link. All right. Hope this video was useful for you. Please subscribe to my channel for more automation and Python videos. Your like and your comment will really help me. Please share my please share the link of my video to your social media channel also. It will help me a lot. Thank you very much for your time. Have a good day ahead.